Morning, it's Dana from Bella Crafts. Right, this week we're gonna be making some birds. We've got Mr. Blue over here and Mrs. Bell. So we're gonna do some painting, some gluing and sticking. We've got lots of textures. We've got wool and some tissue paper. So if you open up your kits, get your painted t-shirts on or your aprons while grown ups, if you can make yourself a nice warm drink and we will get started. I just talk you through what we've got here. So we've got our nest, which will be painted brown. We've got our two birds here. So beaks, the wool, and just some tissue paper. So first thing I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna use a sponge because I like the texture. And I'm gonna paint these birdies all nice and blue. Like so, just move that to the side. Like that and now time for the other one over here just get some more color you don't have to go all the way to the bottom here I'm not because we're gonna glue that to the back of the nest and it gives my fingers somewhere to hold the paper <laughs> so if I just cover that on here If you want to, maybe you can add some colors such as purple or greens, just to give them a bit more of a 3D effect. But I think I'm gonna stick with blue today. Um, now you can leave that to dry or we can go straight on to the tissue paper. So if we get some of these, and I'm gonna scrunch them up by rolling them in my fingers like that. And I'm gonna grab a dab of blue and just pop that on here there and everywhere like that make sure to leave a little bit of space for the face you don't have to screw them up if you wanted to you can leave them pretty open like that. It's entirely up to you, little ones. I think I'm gonna do a mixture of both. Like so. Time to add a bit more glue. Maybe some at the bottom here, the top. I'm just going to move them to the side and do the other one. Now with a nest, I'm gonna use a paintbrush. So just get a little bit of paint on and cover the whole thing. Don't worry again if you get little streaks in, I think it gives it a nice little effect. Most nests made by birds have lots of different materials. So they can be made out of feathers, they can be made out of dry grass, 
They could be made out of anything that birds find. How's that looking? Pretty brown. So if I put that in there for a little bit of a clean, and now I think we're going to add the wool. So these are nice and soft so that the baby birds have something to cuddle. So again, I'm just gonna pop some glue. You might wanna let your paint dry or maybe pop the glue on straight away or pop the wool onto the wet paint it's completely up to you or shall i say your little ones and there we go A case of glowy fingers again. Last piece. Ta da! Right, might seem a bit messy, but I promise it's going to look really good in a second. So if I put this to the side and I bring back our little birdies, like so. I think. We're going to start off with the beaks. So with beaks, I would suggest giving them a little bit of a bend to make it stand out and popping a little bit of glue on the end. So for Mr. Bell, oh, sorry, Mr. Blue, I'm going to pop him in the middle. And we've got another one, which again, just going to give it a bend, add some glue, and pop down. Right, I think we are missing something. What are we missing? Let's have a look. Um, the eyes, right. So... If Mr. Blue has big eyes, I think. Big eyes because he's on the lookout. There we go. Oh, quite like it. And Mrs. Bell, I think, is going to be very, very girly with long lashes. Oh. That doesn't look quite right. There we go. Easy fix. And now we're just gonna leave them for a little bit and we're going to add some sparkles. So if we start off with some gluing, I'm just gonna smudge this all around the edges. And I'm putting the sparkles on the edge just because I don't want the birds to get spiked with any sequins. 
So if you'd like, you can either put them on individually like this, or we can sprinkle them on like this, and then just poke them in the places that you want them. Finally, I think we're just going to add the birds. So if you pop some glue just at the bottom here, like that, nice amount on, there we go, lift up your nest and pop them underneath, like that. And I'm going to do the same for Mrs. Bell over here. So again, get a nice amount of glue along the bottom here. And then push down. To be honest, I will probably leave them to dry for quite a while just to make sure that all this glue turns transparent and clear. And then we're all done. You have Mr. and Miss Bird.